Hey vlog, it is Saturday, October 1st, and it is 12-12. We're now in the month October vlog, so yay, new beginnings this month. Um, right now, I'm about to start on my paper because I got a paper due that's due on Monday. Today's Saturday, so I want to at least get a page done. Then later on, I'm going to go to the gym. And I got to fill out some stuff and do some stuff for school. Like, that's when everything today because they're open. So that's all I'll really be doing today. But I'm feeling good great guys like i'm just feeling good and on track last night i made out a um to-do list of what i'm gonna do today and so far it's going fine so yeah hey vlog 6 7 p.m and i've been doing i've been working on my paper for some time now I finally finished it i'm not finished all the way but i do know i can add like a little bit of stuff here and there but for the most part i met the um word requirements and get all my ideas out so just a little touch-ups here and there i'm not eating nothing today like I don't know what to say about that like it's crazy to me but i'm about to eat something i want to go to the gym today before it get a little bit too dark so i have to like eat something relax a little bit because my back kind of hurt i'm sitting up when that paper but i'm about to eat something then i'll i'm gonna try to go to the gym no later than seven o'clock hey vlog so it's 7 28 p.m right now and i'm at the go inside the gym i'm feeling pretty decent i kind of wasn't feeling that well like about 15 minutes ago i was feeling kind of like nauseous or queasy or something maybe that's because i drank my pre-workout drink and i don't know i just felt like my heart is like kind of beating fast right now because it's working but yeah i'm about to go in so i don't know and i was kind of getting a headache as well and just feeling nauseous like i had ate some food i had felt real happy after i had ate some food and then like a couple minutes later i started to move around a little too much i guess and my head started to kind of hurt and then i sat down for a minute i let myself like sit down then i drank the drink and mm, i don't know but i guess i'll say i'm feeling seven out of ten right now we're gonna go to the gym get this workout in so yeah also, do y'all see the moon? It's a crescent. Hey vlog, I'm leaving the gym. I did an hour on a trade now and five minutes on a stair thing. Um, the gym closed also. I'm just leaving. Hello everyone, it is October 2nd, Sunday, and it is 3.46 a.m. and I'm up doing nails, honey. Um, I kind of freestyled this one. At first I put a matte on here, but I didn't like it, so then I covered it with top coat to make it shiny again. So, I like it better shiny. I'm about to show y'all how it look, and I also tried to draw Courage the Cowardly Dog, so... Hey vlog, it is Sunday, October 2nd, and it's like 1.50 p.m. right now. I'm thinking about doing some more nails today. Um, I made me a nail page. I'm going to be posting like all my nail pictures and nail videos on this Instagram. It's called Pretty Nails by Ari, so make sure you go follow that page to see all my nail stuff. Thinking about doing nails again, so I'm probably going to get up and go do it feeling okay um let's see a seven out of ten last night i was really just like going i was y'all i was really going through it like <laughs> i was just so sad because i just feel so lonely like i don't have nobody here with me like i know i got people people love me and stuff like that but i don't have no friends or family in this town it's just me and then it's one thing from it's a really big difference because my mom isn't here anymore my mom was the main person i went to like for any and everything that was my best friend so it's like it's hard because she's not here then it's hard because i'm away from like family and friends like if i want to go somewhere i'm gonna to have to travel and stay there for days so it's just like it's hard and then 
a person who was here like even when my mom like was gone I always had a person that was with me that I could like go to talk to like they were always like come for me and just be there for me I don't want to say too <laughs> I don't want to say too much <laughs> I don't want to speak too much on them right now because um it'd be like a lot of ups and downs but I am really grateful and blessed to have a person like that in my life that person had to move so now they're not here and now I'm just like by myself for real for real so it's just like it's even harder like it's really hitting me now that like I'm by myself usually um that person would have been came comfort me and like just help me get my mind off things we would have like played a game or something or just did something like I can bet give me a hug just you know just be there for me and just really miss that and I was talking to them last night and I didn't go to sleep until like seven seven in the morning um I was up doing nails I got mad about something I, I boy <laughs> I'm really working on it like I'm trying I'm trying not to let stuff bother me and just turn up and be crazy how I want to be because it's not good for me so I like I saged super heavy like I saged um I burned some wood um I turned my lights on that I don't even turn on. Like, I have not turned that on since in so long. I'm going to show I'm going to turn it on. Did I unplug it? Uh, nope, they're on. Turned those lights on. I was just really, like, mad about something. But then I just let it go. I tried to let it go. Take deep breaths. I tried meditating. I tried listening to music. It was it worked and it was good. But then that's when I just did nails because I just wanted I needed a distraction. And then eventually I cooled down and then I just got like really upset because that person not here with me. And I just like miss everybody and stuff and we was just up. I was just talking. I knew it was so tired, but I was just talking, talking, talking. But I think well I know I'm gonna be okay you know um i'm definitely gonna be okay i definitely stay praying to god about everything and i'll be visiting chicago soon because i can't i can't you do it let me just stop i was gonna say i can't keep doing this but i am a family gal i like to be around my family and friends and it's just really the fact that i don't have anyone here like it's not like like i'm going days and weeks without seeing people I know and don't talk like and then like you know people have their own lives and stuff like that so people be busy too and I don't know guys I don't know I don't want to get too deep into this so I'm done here hey vlog it is 6 31 and I'm just just got done like turning out all my assignments that was due this week and some for next week I'm feeling pretty good guys um I'm gonna say right now I'm feeling a 9 out of 10 I took a break from doing my nails um the practice nails I just laid acrylic on there so I'm about to go finish that up um but yeah so far I think everything is going good I'm feeling good and that's all I really gotta say hey guys so it is nine o'clock and i just did another set of nails this nail set is dedicated to breast cancer awareness month and also to my grandma and also my auntie mommy they both had breast cancer and i just want to say that i love the color pink i support breast i mean not support breast cancer but f cancer all kinds of cancers and you know just stay positive so these are my nails vlog what in the world okay that's messed up oh and it's a little bit sticky don't know how that happened we're just gonna ignore it <laughs> y'all that just really shocked me hey vlog it is 9 53 p.m and right now i'm basically winding down to go to bed i'm eating chicken nuggets for dinner again yes i've been surviving off chicken nuggets for the past week but this week i'm going shopping so we're gonna definitely switch it up real fast um 
I'm about to watch some Netflix until I get tired. But overall, today has been really well. I was able to do some practice nails, finish my paper, finish some work that's due next week. So, so far, I'm feeling good. I'm feeling great. I'm gonna say I'm feeling a nine. Um, other than that, that's all I gotta say. Hey vlog, it's 11.03 and for one, let me turn on a little flashlight. I got Vaseline on my face, so that's why it's a little bit, you know, greasy. But I'm watching this Demir, Jeffrey Demir. Let it would have been somebody black. He would have been caught. Because what? How did he even get away with all of this stuff with so many people and then like i just i just ask god to literally like i pray for this world like even though like just people people are really crazy bro like really ill like i'm just sitting here like make it make sense bro make it make sense because what they sitting at the dinner um table right now i am on episode five called blood of their hands um the time is at 32 minutes and 13 seconds out of 18 or 18 more to go. i don't know but that's where i'm at so yeah that's all i had to say because i'm just sitting here like and like no 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 i know why i said make it make sense because he literally just came from court and if y'all know he got a drinking problem, why are you offering him more beer? He's on his second beer. You're on his first. The lady got half cup of wine, sipping it. Like, he just... And then for the for his grandma to pay his bill, and then he's going to say some... It was a setup? What? What? Y'all, he going to... This, this, they going to blow me? They going to blow me? Okay, guys, I'm about to finish watching it because... <sighs> Good morning, vlog. Today is Monday, October 3rd, and it is 11.26 a.m., and I'm feeling pretty decent. I'm about ready to take my hair now um, this week. Um, I don't know, I'm kind of I'm not exactly over it, but I'm just... I like to have stuff out of my face, and my to-go-to hairstyles for a lot of things is ponytail, so yeah. Um, but I'm about to be doing some knotless braids this week. So far, my morning is going good. You see my face all shiny because I put on grease on my face. And also, y'all know how like when you find something that you haven't seen in like a long time, do you start using it again? Well, that's me right now. I got this Love Rose Plus Vanilla. It's from Bath and Body Works. And it's pillow mist, but you can spread like in your room or around your bed. And this will give you like um, calm vibes. It says... Spray a light mist over pillow or bed lines to calm your mind and uplift your heart. Allow fabric to dry. So basically, I, I be spraying this like crazy. Like, come on. <laughs> I need to be calm. I need to be cool, you know. But I'm my heater on right now if y'all can hear it in the bath. Um, that's all I got to say. Feeling pretty good. I'm fit for today is pretty crazy. Um, Not even crazy. Just a pink shirt. Blue pants. It looked like I could go to the gym. Well, this is what I do wear to the gym, which is some sweatpants and a shirt. But it's getting cold outside, and I'm just like, I want to be bundled up. Not bundled up, but. I'm so cute. That's all I gotta say. So cute. Hey, vlog. Just got out of class. Class was very good and informational. I learned some stuff that I found out was pretty cool. I mean, that I think is cool. Um, I say today is a, so far I'm feeling like a 9 out of 10. Um, I have to go grocery shopping just to get a few things to leave it on. I'm tired. Okay, I gotta go grocery shopping. I'm not gonna go home though. I was gonna go grocery shopping like right now. But I don't want to rush and I want to really think of the things I want to get. I mean like a little list in class, but I want to take my time and not just like rush. So um, I'm going to go home and then I got a Zoom class later. And then that's when I will make my little list. And then I want to go to the gym. So 
that's the plans for today and what I'm gonna be doing so I changed my mind. I'm at Walmart right now because for one, I'm hungry. When I get back, I do not want to eat chicken again. So I'm like. Hey guys, so I'm in Walmart because um, I needed to have some food to get back at home. And I was gonna come later, but I need some food now. So I'm doing a little shopping, getting some healthy stuff because I should. Well, most of it is healthy. I just got like a little bit of um, these kind of chips because I miss chips and I really have went a while with them. So I'm just like, I can give myself just a little bit because I love how famous, but you got pretzels, sun chips, and those are pretty good too. So like for me, so like, if I want to do something I want, I'm try to find something that's kind of similar in a way. So. Hey guys, so I'm done shopping. This stuff I got. Couple things, couple things. <laughs> hey guys, it's 2 4. I was able to put all my groceries up and still make it to Zoom. <laughs> um, my computer is on my um, couch because, you know, I just joined the class and I was still putting up a few things. But I just put some food in the air fryer, which is spicy chicken nuggets and fries. I really needed some fries. I love. The spicy chicken nuggets um that i have because they're chicken breasts and i love chicken breast chicken is my favorite thing ever so um i'm switching out putting on my house shoes right now just putting everything up i feel pretty good though i feel like um i just feel a lot good that i went shopping i kind of spent like well i kind of i got all that i like i made the little list in class and i got everything in a few extra things um, so these are the chicken tenders that I like. I mean, the chicken nuggets. And I got those from Walmart. And something new that I just got is this. They remind me of like little different dots. I never had them before, but that's how they look. I also got some jumbo fries right here. Uh, pot pie. Some more stuff, guys. But right now I'm about to, um, look at zoom and stuff and sit down i'm pretty high i just i brought in two cases of water child so two cases but okay guys hey vlog so right now i'm still in my zoom class don't make it food and stuff but i just really miss my mom and i feel like i live life in a rush to see my mom like not exactly in a rush but it's just like when will i see you like i I've been grateful for every single thing, like, more lately now, like, a lot more lately, like, just waking up for everything I have, for having a place to call home, to be able to get the things I need and be able to provide for myself, like, that ain't nothing but God. God sticks with me, walking me through life, and life is just so hard right now, like, it's like this, like, I'll just be able to call up my mom and just talk to her about any and everything, and I'm just really missing my mom right now, like, I just really miss my best friend, because I could just go to her about any and everything, and that was just really my comfort person, and it's just real hard, but I'm trying to just, I don't know. It's just really hard. I'm just really missing my mom. Hey vlog, it is 5.50 p.m. and I'm feeling really good. Like I just did, um, I just finished my little discussion thing. I don't got no um, work I gotta do. Tomorrow I have therapy. And I know I'm just feeling really good. I'm feeling on track and aligned with things. And I just really love this for me. I really love the growth I'm seeing in myself. I really love that changing for the better and I'm picking up healthier habits. Like I'm just so, 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 so proud of myself. And I just love myself so much for just always trying and pushing, even when it gets hard, you know? Um, I'm just so proud of myself and I just gotta give myself a pat on the back and a hug because this is self-love and I'm just so proud of myself. Like one thing about it, I'm always be so proud of myself because it's hard to do things. It's hard to wake up in the morning and it's hard to live life. Like it's hard, but you know, we got this. So if you just need some motivation, just keep going. Like you got it. Like 
you definitely got this no matter what you're going through like it's gonna be some trouble here and there but just keep god um first you know and just do the best you can pray just don't give up on yourself show up for yourself always think positive look at the brighter side of things and ignore the negativity cut out the people in your life ask god to remove people that's not going to help you get to where you want to be and just help you reach your goals and just not like genuine towards you and you know ask god to help you not desire the things that's not good for you because we desire things but sometimes what we desire isn't what's good for us so just ask god to like put your desires into other places and I don't know, I'm just I'm just feeling so good. I just really want y'all to know that you got this. I believe in you. I really believe in you. And they like you can get through anything. Like anything you set your mind to, you can get through it. Like if you ever want to talk to me or anything, you can talk to me. Like I'm here. We're getting through this life stuff together. Together. You you that's watching me, we getting through life together. Like right here, right now yeah right here and right now we're getting it together and it's only going to continue to get better because as we grow we experience more things in life and our experiences and the way we feel and think about things they change because of experience we learn from what we go through and all we can do is just improve and get better even if it don't seem like it just know that you're definitely improving and get better it takes baby steps you have to take little by little to get to where you want to be and you're gonna get there so just keep that in mind don't give up and just stay focused like don't let nothing throw you off your track your square and none of that you know keep those positive energies up and going and just believe in yourself like know that you can do it because you can't and if you can't please tell me why not you better not say nothing because you can put your mind to anything you want and that's period you want me to say it a hundred times or something you don't believe me because you can do it you can do it you can do it you can do it you can do it, you can do it. <laughs> okay guys but i'm just saying i definitely believe in you you got this like with just everything but okay guys i'm gonna stop this here because i'm gonna just i'll keep going on and on for hours because i'm just so happy like i'm just really blessed and thankful for life like just waking up like being able to like just being here like i'm like when i tell you i've been really practicing gratitude like every single day like i just thank god so much for like waking me up i am a person that's got woken up today i'm able like i just thank god for everything like I just thank God for having a roof over my head, a home I can call mine. I'm like, even like when I'm walking, like walking to my car to go to class or whatever, I'm grateful that I have fresh air. I step outside, I got fresh air to see. I have clean clothes, I got hot, cold water, meals. I can eat food, clean water. I thank God that I even have a car. I thank God for letting my car start up. I thank God for, like, you know, just everything he's placed in my life and just helping me. And just, I don't know. I'm just so, 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 so grateful for everything God has done for me. And I will continue to be. I will continue to serve God, baby, because my life is my testimony. Everything I'm going through, it's my testimony. Like, this right here life is a test to see what you're gonna do and how you're gonna handle it literally that's what life is and my life is my testimony like i've been through some stuff i have i came overcame a bunch of things and i just really sit here and think like i really want to know what would my mom say or how she feel like about how i am now and just i don't know because it's just such a difference like earlier i was really missing my mom and i still freaking do like i just miss my mom so much but for the most part i think like i wonder what would she think or how would she feel like i just really miss talking to her like she was really my best friend like literally i don't know but everything i'll be okay hopefully hopefully because when it comes to my mama boy i don't know now 
but what i am going to do is try to stay positive keep my spirits up and high and stay happy um and just you know do the best that i can and just continue on because i know my mom is oh so proud of me and like she's just i know she's just really proud of me i just wish i could hear her say it and i wish i can just like just see her like look at me anything i don't know but <laughs> Okay guys, I'm going to end it here and next time you see me, I'll uh, probably be on my way to the gym or at the gym. Hey guys, it is 6.26 right now and I'm about to try this energy drink um, before I go to the gym. It's called Blue's Blue Rise Hydration Sensation, so I can probably chug this down. It, it tastes, it, it's not acidy at all. It tastes straight like juice or some like watery juice. Maybe my taste buds off. I don't know. I'm going to get this uh, taste-wise, maybe a 8 out of 10. Y'all, okay. <laughs> Y'all, the motivation to come to the gym, like, right, right, right now, what's the sunset? Because I don't want to go when it be dark because it be dark. But the sunset be pretty, so see it a little bit. Y'all can't see it, but it was just real cute. So I'm about to try to get there and go. It's 632. So this is the sky right now. But on the other side, it's like orange. Super duper orange. We'll see when I get in there how it looks. I'm working so This is very cool. Hey vlog, it's 8, 10 p.m. and I'm headed home now. I got a little bit of a tiny head behind him, but I was on the treadmill the entire time. Look at the moon. It's a half moon, um, but okay. Hey guys, it's 8.21 and I just made it home. Um, right now I'm about to do a little self-care and use some beat on me to get me bald <laughs> and then i'm about to take down my hair now i know i should really keep this style up but i'm kind of over it um one because in the back these two keep sticking up i redid these today but i don't know i'm just ready i want change i'm ready for change so i'm gonna take down my hair um wash it blow dry it and then i'm gonna try to start on it if i have the energy but as for right now i'm about to sit down put the beat on and while that's on me i'm going to be taking out my hair now i'm about to get in the shower and then make dinner i'm sorry guys my hair is itchy but okay hey vlog it's 11:50, and i'm watching princess and the frog i just got on taking down my hair and washing it right now it's just in this turban towel thingy so I don't think I'm a blow dryer or a start on my hair tonight. Like, taking down my hair took longer than I thought it would. So, that took, like, most of my energy. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, but, yeah, I'm just washing Princess and the Frog and making me some um, food. And then, I'm going to bed. Hey, vlog. It's Tuesday, October 4th. And it is 11.31, I believe. 11.32 right now. I'm in my Zoom class, y'all. We plan Jeopardy going over a little review because we got to take a quiz um, the next class time. I'm a little bit out of breath. I had to put a new nose ring in. Mine came out yesterday. This color is gold. Um, I'm feeling okay. I'm pretty cold. I got my heater on if y'all can hear it in the back of my cover. I got on Zoom just like this. I took that little thing off. Awesome. And guess what? We got five extra points because sometimes she be she be on it about the seeing your camera. And the people who had the camera got five extra points, so I needed that. Thank God. But so far, I'm going. I guess a seven out of ten. I got therapy later on. I hope that goes okay. I'm feeling pretty good mentally and physically. So yeah. It should go well. Um, well, I don't know why I gave myself a seven there. Like, I'm happy. Like, I I feel good. But therapy-wise, mm, whatever. <laughs> um, but okay, y'all. Oh, and also, when I said yesterday I was doing self-care with um the V and stuff and I was going to get bald, I don't know if y'all care, but yeah. 
so I like that because I just put it on sit down for about 20 minutes even though you're supposed to keep it on for I think like 10 or 15 I do it for how long I feel really I do it for like about 20 25 minutes to make sure you get everything and then scoop it up and I just found out the spatula that come with it you put it on there and then you can also scoop it up I used to wipe it off with like a towel and stuff but I feel like scooping it up is way better and it's just way better I like that y'all look at me my hair is so cute I gotta comb it I gotta get my like my curls are cute I gotta get ready for therapy I'm gonna have to blow dry my hair I really low-key don't want to go because I'm feeling okay and if I wanted to cancel I would have to cancel like around eight o'clock this morning at eight o'clock so I can't or they're gonna charge me a fee so I gotta go so maybe you could just be sure like I'm not saying it's bad or anything but I don't feel like I'm in a good space but I guess I'll just say that so yeah y'all look at me <laughs> y'all I be in the mirror looking at myself and I be like I love you so much like I love myself so much and then like my eyes and start like dilating like my pupils will start getting big and when your pupils get big that means you are attracted so to somebody you are in love or it's somebody you i think like i think it's i think it's somebody you find attractive i tell myself that and i just be like i'm just so beautiful <laughs> like you really gotta tell yourself you love yourself and you're beautiful and stuff like that at every phase every time every just every time any any chance you get because i used to really have a low self-esteem like when i was like younger really 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 low self-esteem like i promise you and i it took me a while to like build it up i built my confidence before and like i'll lose it lose confidence and gain it build it just working on my confidence and stuff like that but now i'm growner now and i love my body i love myself sometimes i do have days when i don't feel the best or look the best or sometimes don't like my body and that's okay but the most important thing is just to keep reminding yourself that you love yourself and that you're beautiful and that like just every phase of you because it's all you when I get to like my goal weight and where I want to be health wise, I'm still going to love my body and I'm going to love it just as much as I love my body now because at the end of the day, I'm still the same Ariel and I'm not going to, you know, be different or anything like that with myself. Um, I'm still the same person. So yeah, but basically just love yourself as much as you can you only got one body you don't, it's only one you nobody is you you are nobody you're yourself so love who you are love how you style yourself love what you wear love how you do your hair love how you do your makeup your nails like if you're different then be different like i'm different i know i'm different <laughs> like and it's okay to like be different like people some people not gonna understand you some people not gonna like what you do like what you say like what you wear like how you think like how you you know just live your life but at the end of the day it's not their life it's your life you're you gonna do what you want to do to make you happy and at the end of the day, the only thing that matters is your happiness because it's your life. You're the only person who got to live it. Everybody else is just watching. Everybody else is just looking to see what you're going to do and how you're going to rea react to it. So what you can do to live your best life is just try to be your best, do your best and be happy and just try and just always keep God first and, you know, just keep praying and stuff like that. So that's all i gotta say like just be you like you're you and love yourself but okay y'all hey guys it's 116 right now i'm about to try to hurry up and blow dry my hair um i'm using this and this and i'm about to just try to hurry up
Hey guys, it's 2.57 and I just got out of therapy. Y'all, I thought I was okay. <laughs> I thought I was okay, baby. We, we got into some things and I cried a couple times. And I just really miss my mom. That's pretty much it. I'm just, I'm feeling really lonely without her. I feel like I'm trying for her. And I'm trying for her, but it's really hard. And I feel really lonely, so. But guys, it's a couple different things um, that we talked about. And I feel really good going. And I got another appointment. I just feel really good about this. I feel better, I guess. Yeah, I feel better. I'm gonna get myself in 9 out of 10. Hey y'all, it's 8.22 p.m. I just woke up from a nap like five minutes ago. I've been asleep since five o'clock, so I've been asleep for three hours. Um, I'm feeling okay, guys. I'm feeling okay. Okay, it's 8.25. I don't know what made me want to get up and sage, but I'm saging. I'm almost running out. Like, this is my last thing, y'all. But I'm still glad I have this much left. But I'm just saging um, right now. I love the smell of sage. And just, like, it really helps me, like, get in a good mood. I'm not saying I'm in a bad mood, but I like the sage. Like, you know, just to sage, you know. It's always good for you. And just, you know, set your intentions. Um... You know, I just want, you know, peace, positivity, you know. And one more thing, guys, one more thing. I am um, watching Disney movies. Yesterday was the first time I ever watched a full movie of Hocus Pocus. So, I know I'm, like, super late. Like, I didn't see a whole bunch of movies, but I never sat down to watch that. So, that's what I'm, like, doing now. Right now, I'm about to, um see if it's, like, any movies I want to watch. Like, any, you know, October movies. You know how they be having like Halloween, Hall I don't know, but Disney used to have like Halloween themed stuff or whatever, so. Yeah, this one I'm just watching now, and I'm also about to um burn some wood. This is called Plano Wood, and this helps relieve anxiety and stress and stuff as well, and I also like the smell of this, so I didn't use it up, so I'm about to, um, you know, just light this and, you know, let it do its thing. Hey guys, so I've decided to watch Edward Scissorhands. I'm gonna wait till it get a little bit brighter. Watch me play with fire. <laughs> Okay guys, so I've decided to watch Edward Scissorhands. It's still pretty dark, so y'all can't really see me, but y'all can see this. Um, I can't wait till this light come on so I can see all the smoke that's right here. Like, <laughs> it's just really going because I lit it like pretty decent. But I love Elder Scissor Hands. I just got put into this movie not too long ago, maybe about two years ago. And y'all, this is why I love Tim Burton. Like, he's raw when it comes to movies and stuff. Like, he's one of my favorite um, like directors. But yeah, I'm just lighting this and finna watch this movie. All my work is pretty much done for today. I did everything. I did some stuff that's due, you know, this weekend. So, like, I'm really on track and ahead of the game in a way. So, yeah. Caesar salad. Hey, vlog. I'm heartbroken right now. I'm like going through it. I'm sad. It's just hard for me right now. I'm just tired of having feelings. Hey vlog, it's October 5th, Wednesday, and it's 10.57 a.m. I'm eating some cereal with a banana. Um... I'm not doing the best. I'm kind of going through something, but that's all I have to say. Hey guys, it's 11.54, and I just want to say I'm grateful for life. 
for being here today. And for being me. Hey y'all, it's 801. I know my hair looking super duper crazy. I blew the dryer earlier, um, came out. I'm about to drink some of this Red Bull. First time having an actual Red Bull. But I'm about to do my hair. It's pretty late. I don't got class like being person tomorrow. So I'm about to style my hair today. It's not that bad. Sloki tastes like candy. I'm gonna get this so. Uh, 9.5 out of 10. This tastes like candy. <laughs> but right now, I'm just watching some on YouTube so I can start on my hair. I already feel it's kicking in right now. So, I'm, yeah. But next time y'all see me, either I'll be complaining on that my hair is taking forever or my hair will be done. Hey, y'all. It's 12.27. No, only, um, so far, I pre-parted my entire head. So, that's pretty cool. Only got two, um two rows down but i'm about to call it a night because i'm pretty tired my butt hurt my back hurt and it's pretty late and i'm about to try to do my exam right now so i don't have to do it tomorrow but i am going to try to wake up tomorrow to do it but y'all so far these are coming out super cute and super neat then at the end i like kind of like made knots on like each um each other braid you can't really tell but like i'll take a little piece of um the hair then like wrap it like you can see right there like just wrap it around and tie it in the knot or whatever because i'm gonna um curl the ends but i think these the neatest i've ever did them but oh basically i'm stopping um right here because my stuff went dead my ipad my phone went dead so i couldn't see what i was doing now my fan going out <laughs> My fan just went out, but I'm going to charge that. But I just got to charge my iPad, my phone, so I can see, be able to see. Because, like, they had went out. That's the only reason I had stopped. I had drunk a Red Bull earlier. I don't know. I feel like the Bang Energy drinks, um, I don't know if they still got those. But the Bang Energy drinks, that one definitely was good. I remember I took one, like, uh, probably a year ago. And, boy, like... I did my whole head, took it down, redid it again, and I still hit energy. That's like it was real good, but I'm about to tie my hair up, um, and then lay down. Now, also like just laid all my hair out that I'm gonna have to um, you know, oops. Basically, I just like already put all my hair and stuff on here, so tomorrow when I wake up, I can just get to it. But okay, guys, I'm gone, y'all. Good morning, vlog. I'm up early. It's 9.39. I'm about to do my exam because I went to bed last night. I'm tired right now, but... Mm. Yeah, I'm about to... Um... Yeah, I just got up. I'm pretty tired, bro. Hey, guys, it's 10.59. I finished my hair, but I didn't flip out the curls yet, so I'm about to just show y'all how I'm about to flip out the curls. Those how the curls look. Now I'm about to fluff them out, fluff everything out. Ah! Why did I do that? Ooh, these cute. Hold on. Period. Okay, so y'all can see the difference. This versus this. Okay, so this is it. Um, it's not really how I expected it in my head, but it's cute, so whatever. Gotta deal with it, cause I already did it. Um, I don't know how I want to style it. I might do. I might do. And I might do like a updo. Okay, so this is the final thing. I vlog it's friday october 7th and it is 11 17 a.m um, 
um this is my hair i've been not so well but i'm here so yeah i did my hair uh that's all that matters really i got on a cardigan today with black shirt and some leggings so y'all i'm looking too cute don't mind my box on the floor but i can't like show you full body but i'm gonna just turn my phone period y'all i um just remembered to do my polaroids and oh i just know they finna come out so cute this one is developing but look how cute that is like come on out come on out like that's so freaking cute okay the second one okay here it is right now I'm trying to hurry it up because I gotta go out. Too cute! I'm too cute! <laughs> come on now. That, come on. Don't play with me. Please don't play with me. Please don't. Please don't. Oh. 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 She too fat. Mama, I promise y'all that's the fattest person I know. She the cutest person I know. Look, look how cute she is. What? You, I ain't never seen somebody that beautiful before. <sighs> oh, thank you, God. Thank you. Y'all, it's 11.59 and I'm irritated because I'm late to class. Oh. <laughs> but it ain't nobody fault but mine. I had to put some air on my tire and the thing was messing up. My tire was on a flat. And that's sad because I need to do better. I need to do better when it comes to checking that. Because I don't want my stuff to be messed up. So, yeah. the clouds are so pretty. That's a cute thing. Y'all, it's giving fall. It's definitely giving fall vibes. Okay, guys, can we just really take? Can we just take the time to appreciate the clouds? Like, can this be real? Like, can you be real? These clouds, I believe, are called Columbus clouds. But, it, like, they, it don't even look weird to me. Like, that's how good it looks. God is an amazing, wonderful, beautiful artist. Of you. Like, they look so big. The clouds. They look like I could touch them. Hold on now. Like the clouds are so big today and beautiful. Guys, so it's 1.23. Right now, I just came from um, filling up all my tires, so that's good. And I also got me, like, some snacks, because I guess I'll have, like, a movie day or something. I don't got nothing to do on the weekend, because, for one, I don't go out. And then, for two, um, I don't have no friends, so... <laughs> What way better not to spend your week Friday getting the movie night? So I'm just getting some snacks. I'm about to go on Aldi's and like find a pizza or something. So yeah. Guys, so it's 147 and I just got home. I just put my pizza and um, my bread in the oven. I think right now, well, today would be a really good time to like do some self-care, self-love. So I'm going to put on some Halloween pajamas and um, watch Halloween movies. And just like this will be like a movie day for me for like how far I've came. I'm just proud of myself. And this is just like a little reward for me. Um, all yesterday I was doing my hair. Yesterday I was having a really hard time. 
um, just in my feelings and stuff like that. But I'm so glad that I have um, friends who love and care for me that I can call on and talk to, text and stuff like that. Big shout out to my cousin Jasmine, my friend Kaya, for like helping me get through what I went through yesterday. I was just like having just a hard time. Um, just about relationship stuff and I was just really sad and it took me a really long time to like finish my hair because I kept stopping like I was just crying throughout yesterday like it was just really hard for me but today I think that this will really um just you know just I don't know give me some type of happiness I guess hey guys so these are the pajamas And I just checked all my stuff. It got like eight minutes left. I just gotta find a movie I wanna watch. And that's all. Hey y'all, so for one, my house is smoky. For two, I took the piece out and I cut it. But the back, look at the back of the pizza. Look at the back of the pizza. <laughs> Hey blog, so I also got me some wine. I'm finna pull me up some wine. The wine that I got is from Aldi's. It's called Winkin' Owl. And it looked like this. So I'm about to pull me up some. It is Saturday, October 8th, and it is 3.54 p.m. My hair's on a ponytail. I really love this hairstyle. It's so cute. Get into it. Um, I got done cleaning up my house. I cleaned my house today. Like, I changed my curtains and everything. Like, I had some light pink curtains. And now they're, like, a light gray. But today, I'm just pretty much relaxing. I don't know. I don't got no work to do this week. Um, so I guess this is really just, like, me getting everything together. Because I love the feeling of a clean house. And, you know, I've just been looking like, I want more, I want more. Then I gotta, like, just take a pause and realize what you do have and take care of what you have. Because, you know, we ask for things, but when we get it, like, we be wanting more. It's just, like, like I would like more space in my house to, like, do different things. Even though I'm very grateful. And I set everything up how I set it, like, my little nail thing. Um, my little nail desk over there my front room i'm so thankful and grateful i even have like two different rooms to go in like if i'm tired of my room i can go in the front you know things like that but like i would just like an apartment with like different rooms i can just go in to like do things <laughs> and i had to tell myself like you know you want these things take care of what you have now be grateful what you have now and those things will come i'm capable of getting all the things that i want and desire and i'm a magnet you know, you have to look at yourself as a magnet so you can track things. And I also saw something on TikTok basically talking about happiness. And we be so busy chasing happiness that we have to let the happiness come to us. And that's totally true. Like, I felt like when I was working and stuff, I was just like, like, I never spent money on myself. Like, all my checks went, like, into my savings. Like, let's say I would make, like, $400, literally $400. I would say, like... 350 of that and like just have 50 dollars to myself for those whole two weeks make it stretch sometimes i don't even use the 50 because i use what i have i use what i have around me and that's what i like been doing so far like i don't know if i'm probably like oversharing or i mean it's no secret though but i have not been employed in over a year and like i said it's nothing but god like it's nothing but god like and i'm so grateful and thankful that um like i just have everything that i do have and you know, I just try to make the best out of everything, what I have, and try to create my own happiness and be my own happiness because why not? Like, I've been really going through it this week, and it's just like, the things that I want somebody else to do for me, I can do for myself. And you know what? It's not even what I want another person to do. It's just really me, like, just feeling lonely and sad. And just because you, like, get sad and lonely, do not have to refriend people you don't have to go like back in your past if you stop talking to people stuff like that don't do that you know life comes with a whole bunch of tests and you know sometimes you might slip up and stuff but you know that's just something for you to learn and experience you got to learn to keep on moving forward and I don't know like I was doing okay and I guess I just haven't been okay really but like I've been journaling like almost every single day like in my phone like in my notes like i'll just be journaling and that's been helping me get like a lot of thoughts and stuff off my chest and just like different things but i say right now i'm a good seven out of ten um really happy that i clean my room clean my kitchen clean my bathroom clean my front like everything is clean and i'm just like really hoping for the best and just want to keep on trying to be positive 
and just i don't know just keep doing the best that i can but thank you guys so much for watching this vlog um this might be the end don't know yet y'all yeah, i know what right now they have different kinds of indian foods they have chicken some laces i got most stuff they got family size ones great value for everything Hey guys, it's Saturday, 6.48. Just came in from Walmart. I'm in a breath because my arm is going to break off. But I just want to show you I'm that girl for real because uh, I carry all the groceries in. It's so many. But y'all, something I am so freaking excited about is this dang Indian food. Like, I really mess with Indian food heavy. And last time I had vegetable samosas, they got chicken. They got chicken bro like what like oh but i'm awake because i'm cooking nachos tonight i'm awake big vlog so i'm about to show y'all my nachos i got hot lemons and doritos with nacho cheese and peppers it look too good i layered it so it's like some at the bottom and at the top because i hate when everything at the top when you get to the bottom there's none left but yeah 